Hey guys, welcome back to Daniel's Tech World here on YouTube. My name is Daniel Rosal. This is my tech channel uh, talking about my tech interests, one of which is definitely backup and archiving. So another video about um, archival media. Um, I was looking at getting a couple more discs just to kind of like add to my collection um, of archival grade CDs and DVDs for smaller chunks of data and I kept coming across two similar looking products from Verbatim who are just about the leader these days in optical media. One of them is what they call their archival grade products. We've talked about those before that it's not necessarily a specific thing but it's a common marketing claim and they have a nice kind of gold layer for both the CVD CDs and DVDs. I don't think they make any um, specific BDR product marketed as archival because they have the blue uh, the M discs for that, um, and of course there are no there are no M disc CDs. So for CDs and DVDs, they have two archival grade products and two products that are called Data Life Plus, which judging by their Amazon description, sound a ki kind of sound like they're also intended for. Uh, archiving. So I wondered what the difference was and I wrote it verbatim and I want to show you guys quickly what they said. So uh, the uh, the the little uh, Google slide presentations again, uh, archival grade verbatim gold versus data life plus, which is better. Um, so just to show the products um, in case people are encountering them, they exist in both CDs and DVDs. And uh, this is what they look like in the world of uh, CDs. The top one here is uh, Verbatim's archival grade CD. They're 700 megabytes. Uh, they have a top write speed of 52X, um, a branded surface hard coat. And you can see these in most, mostly the 50 spindles these days. They did make them in a kind of box of five, but they seem to be less, a little bit less commonplace. Um, unless my mathematics are wrong, which is very, always very possible, um, it, they, these guys work out to $1.60 per disc. And these are what I, the Data Life Plus, you can see they're, they're titled on Amazon Data Life Plus, and uh, you have Data Life Plus written on the uh, product packaging. Um, these guys are considerably cheaper using the uh, price before the discount. They work out to 60 cent a disc. So um, it's a difference of um, about roughly four times in the price that the archival grade ones are four times more expensive. Um, and uh, just to also show the products in DVD, you have uh, a similar situation. They make both an archival grade DVD product, the one up here. Um, these are $108 for a 50 spindle with a max write speed of 8x, 4.7 gigs. And then they also have these Data Life Plus uh, DVD products. As you can see, the, the write speed is the max write speed is double at 16x. Um, and these ones you can print on. And their regular price is 31 bucks. Uh, they're currently on Amazon for only 16, which is actually a great deal that uh, people lucky enough to have Amazon shipping in the US, this might be a good time to uh, to stock up. So I wrote to Verbatim and I, I asked them what the difference was and which is better basically. And I got an answer pretty quickly. Uh, so this is what they uh, wrote back to me. They said the archival grade have an advantage to the Data Life Plus CD and their superior. Um, the archival grade is manufactured using proprietary dual reflective layers, this DRL, what they call DRL, to maximize compatibility and longevity. The dual reflective layer technology consists of a sil silver layer for broad compatibility and a gold layer for long archival life. The gold layer, the gold layer uh, prevents oxygen from corroding the silver reflective layer. Uh, which is which is a problem for uh, for optical. So basically, the gold layer is there to keep out stuff that might destroy the data. Um, but the highly reflective silver layer allows the archival grade disc to look like a silver disc to optical drives and recorders, providing a low initial error rate and increased compatibility. Um, then for the uh, so I asked about CDRs, but I think I'm pretty certain that this would apply to the DVDs as well. Uh, the CDs uh, slash DVDs Data Life Plus ones just have a single reflective layer and uh, they can do 52x as we saw for the CDs and they use uh, the Verbatim's Azo die um, for greater performance. Uh, Azo recording die is a patented technology, blah, blah, blah. Okay, um, so that is basically the answer. Uh, just a little bit more about the expected lifespan for these products, for the archival grade products. So they do cost about three to four times as much 
um, but uh, they are supposed to be better verbatim is saying that they're better if you're looking for the best archival grade CDs and DVDs on the market. I think those might be it. Uh, the archival DVDs, they say uh, their claim is up to 100 years. And for archival CDs, they make the same claim of up to 100 years if they are, with the caveat that they have to be stored properly to get the lifespan. And uh, I don't think I actually needed this one. So that's um, that's it, basically. Uh, that's the difference. And uh, if you're looking for the very best archival that uh, you can get in CD and DVD within verbatim, I think uh, these two ones would be uh, would be good choices or that's what they recommend over the Data, Data Life Plus uh, product options. Thanks for watching. Until the next video.